Hanging is a simple way to get fit and healthy. It's easy to do, and it's inexpensive. We should all regularly hang from things like pull-up bars, monkey bars, and tree branches. It can be done at any time of the day. It's one of the most overlooked forms of exercise that if included in regular activities, can have significant positive effects. In this video, we will tell you the eight reasons why you should hang daily. But before we continue, click the subscribe button. Number one, spinal decompression. The majority of the movements and activities we engage in as part of our modern lifestyles stress our spines. Long durations of sitting, carrying heavy objects, squatting, and even sleeping can all cause the spine to compress. When you hang, your body weight will gradually extend your spine. The spinal discs, which are the gel-like cushions between the bones in your spine, will feel less pressure. If you have any disc problems, this might be resolved, and nutrients could enter the body to aid in your recovery. This also relieves back pain and strain, but it also aids in injury prevention. Number two, increases shoulder mobility. Your upper body can completely relax while hanging passively with your arms in the air. Your range of motion in the shoulder joint and general shoulder health is being improved with every second you spend in this position. Many of us are focused on size and strength. Therefore, range of motion and mobility are ignored. This exercise improves the range of motion across the shoulder joint capsule, which not only helps you to perform overhead movements safely, but is also helpful in preventing injury. Number three, corrects posture. Because both of your arms are parallel to the pull-up bar, the weight of your body is shared equally between the two. This helps to realign the body, straighten your back, and address any imbalances that have accidentally formed in the body. When working at a desk, you could tend to lean more to one side than the other, or to keep your shoulders rounded. These practices can be harmful to the body, resulting in unequal knee strength or overpronation of the foot. This can be corrected by performing the hang every day. Number four, strengthens your forearms. Because most upper body exercises focus on developing their biceps and triceps, many people overlook their forearms. However, the hang is a workout that strengthens our forearms since it has an operational purpose. The forearms, wrists, and palms, which bear the weight of the entire body, develop considerable strength with consistent practice. This strength can help us in daily activities like pulling, pushing, and lifting. Number five, upper body stretch. Your upper body is worked largely during the hang. It's an excellent stretching workout for your back, arms, shoulders, and abdominal muscles. This is made possible by the opposing forces of your palms gripping the bar and the gravitational pull of your body. It relieves any stiffness in the body, which is why playing on monkey bars as a child felt so nice. The hang stretches the upper body muscles. Number six, strengthens your core. To perform any strength training activity, such as push-ups, planks, or crunches, core strength is necessary. The hang is a comprehensive workout that works every area of the upper body, including the back, abdomen, arms, and shoulders. This strengthens your core. It improves general strength and endurance. Number seven, works on your lats. When performing the hang, you'll notice immediately how much stretch is produced via your lats. The hang is a great static stretch for your lats and other muscles. The extension of your lats while in the hang position keeps these muscles flexible and healthy. This will be reflected in your push and pull routines, where your lats will be doing the majority of the work. Number eight, improves your grip. The most efficient way to strengthen your grip is by doing hangs. Because the hang requires you to hold onto a bar for an extended period, your hands are likely to slide off easily. This is even if you have the stamina to keep hanging. But as you get better, the chance of this happening decreases. Once you become accustomed to practicing the hang, your hand's grip becomes stronger. It strengthens and increases the flexibility of the muscles in your wrist and fingers. If you want to know what happens to your body if you do deadlifts, watch this video. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe for more interesting videos about your health.